Hello, today we're going to talk about the D scale. In order to play the D scale, you have to have the right hand position first. And what you need to make sure you do is if you put, put your first finger on the first finger tape, third finger on the third finger tape, fourth finger on the fourth finger tape. That's your pinky. All right. Now, if you turn your cello around, you, your thumb should be behind that second finger. Okay, make sure the thumb is placed behind that second finger. Now your hand's set up in the correct position to play the D major scale. So why don't we go ahead and play open D. That's your second string, open D. First finger E, making sure that, sec that thumb stays behind our second finger, even though it's not placed on the fingerboard. So first finger E. Place your second, then your third finger down. That's F sharp. Good. Fourth finger, G. Now switch to open A. That's your first string. First finger, B. Careful, your thumb stays put. It doesn't move. So first finger, B. Place your second and third down. That is third finger, C sharp. And then fourth finger, pinky, D. Now we've gone all the way up the D scale. Now we have to go all the way back down. So fourth finger, pinky, D. Third finger, C sharp. First finger, B. Open A. To the D string. Now we're playing fourth finger G. Good. Third finger F sharp. First finger E. And then open D. But you notice my thumb stayed behind that second finger the entire time. Okay. You have to make sure that stays. It's not off to the side. It stays right behind that second finger. Okay. So let's try that again a little bit faster now. Ready? Go D, E, F sharp, third finger, fourth finger G, open A, first finger B, third finger C sharp. There you have it. That is the D major scale.